I would like to address some of you upcoming uh, street preachers. You have to understand you're not going to be a pulpit preacher. Uh, you're not going to preach in very nice places. As a matter of fact, where God will send you, it's going to be a little bit dirty. Unfortunately, most ministers see their flock dressed nice, looking nice, smelling nice on Sunday. But we see them from Monday through Saturday at any given place. And so uh, uh, that flock is a mess. And uh, you have to understand when you preach open air, it's not going to be glamorous. Uh, unfortunately, God's going to send you into the filth, the uh, wickedness. You're going to understand why even at one point God resented even making mankind. And so you need to count the cost. There's nothing glamorous. There's nothing wonderful and beautiful. It's not uh, you can forget about being a missionary to Hawaii. If you're going to be an open air preacher, your hands are going to get dirty because the field that you're going to plow is filthy. You're going to look at sin in a whole different way. As a matter of fact, if you're a good street preacher, you're going to hate sin. You're going to despise sin. You're not just going to dislike it. You're going to understand why God destroyed Sodom and Gomorrah and why God destroyed the world with, with water and flood. And so uh, if you're a young open air preacher, this is what you're going to have to look up to. This is going to be the, the, the field in which you're going to be plowing in. And you need to rejoice in that and understand you're going to be hated, despised, and jailed to work in, in a place like this. Because one day, I'm going to die, and I'm going to be with the Lord, and all this will be yours.